Hey everyone, this is the new Rainbow Mage. Uh, this is the list I've been playing. It's the strongest performing list at High Legend. Uh, there are other lists out there, but none of them have the win rate that this one does. Um, and uh, But people are asking me uh, about the... But basically, it's kind of very similar to old styles, but the big new cards it has, it has the Puzzle Master Cadgar, it has the Sleet Skater, and it has the Frost Lich Cross Stitch, which got buffed from 5 to 4. And this matters a lot because uh, it is able to get Ward Elementals, which are really good against Demon Hunter. This deck is really built to beat Demon Hunter. Um, even the, the, the Cosmic Keyboard, I've had you know some pro players say they don't really like it. But it's a really, really strong card against Demon Hunter, even though it's on 2. Uh, even though it's not as good... Uh, in certain matchups where it gets a little bit more awkward. But still, you know, often you're getting 4-4 worth of stats from this card, even if you get like a 2-2 and a 1-1 and a 1-1. So it's still not terrible in that scenario. Uh, I remember this card was a card that people were thinking was absolutely busted before when you had, you know, the, the cold case. But bottom line uh, is this deck is very similar to the old, uh, except we have a lot more armor gain. <clears throat> we're ramping up. Or we're sort of, you know, we're just playing our cards, we're getting our spells, schools ready, and then we're sifting OTK. So, uh, big thing, big chase is Puzzle Master Cadgar. I say Puzzle Master Cadgar is your good friend who's not really reliable. A really, really powerful card, but if you're just completely relying on him to hit a blizzard or something like that, you're going to be set out because it does have a certain randomness. It does do better things for you on average, but it definitely does some troll stuff. So, don't be too reliant on the Puzzle Master. Uh, uh, but yeah, uh, just be playing your cards and uh, um, so and going towards your Sif OTK. So uh, in general, what am I keeping in the Mulligans? Um, in general, the cards I like are uh, Miracle Salesman, Cosmic Keyword, and Sleet Skater is uh, a keep in a lot of matchups. So especially Demon Hunter. Uh, Frostless is good against Demon Hunter as well. Um, and then any uh, matchups that aren't aggressive, Puzzle Master is really good, but be careful. Matchups are aggressive, Puzzle Master is really bad. For example, Demon Hunter is really bad, but in the mirror, it's really, really good. So, anyways, I got some games for you guys. Enjoy. Threads of Despair, dude, that is a good, is a good card. Thank you. Uh, that's what I get. I think I have to kill this. It's too dangerous to left alive. But I mean, I have discovery, so I, want, I would like to get my Sif fully invoked. I have to remember, I probably should keep Flame Elemental in hand, right? Um, Play around Dirty Rat. Hmm. If I had known I was going to top deck that. Bro, this card is completely worthless. <laughs> Dude, what is how terrible these are, chat? I will never be able to play this. Legs. Ah, I take cash strike here, right? Oh my god, dead. <laughs> like, I don't have Divine Shield minions. I've used both my discoveries now, so I probably have to like go molten runes for random cards and nonsense. Thank you, Peppa. Me some good glyphy boys. Ooh, I could take another stargazing. Ooh, one mana molten is too insane. That's like a win condition. 
Uh, ooh, do I take the immediate infantize here? Yeah, I think I do. Start infantizing here. I guess if I time this right. I mean, the other cards are terrible, right? So we'll never, like, our... Thank you. out on Dude, my hand is too much, like, fluff. Do you write your own code <laughs> as stories for chat? Yeah, they're local, dude. Um, yeah. I kind of like this just as like an intermediate play like if they don't play Odin it's like a, just a powerful play though it's probably wisdom but I don't know what do you guys think um sunset here like next turn if they play Odin I can't go sunset which sucks right I miss no hands birthday bonanza Big spells equals good. All right, we took it. They play all that. Wait, they just have a nothing turn. They got dirty rat me. Welcome to the grand tournament. Hey, but. Amazing. Hey, but. My thanks. That's illegal. Ah! 
Bring up take up. <laughs> That's actually the This guy know as I Dude, I did not I did not see this coming, dude. Actually pretty uh So, five. This is awkward. I kind of have to like get rid of shit in my hand here. Reality. Whoa. I just tempoed this, to be honest. How much damage does my Sif have right now? It's only at plus six spell damage. Uh, I kind of need nature. But I have some good shit though. Um... Dude, I have infinite cry observations, and they just never like. My opponent just like never. <laughs> they never play Odin, so it's like kind of pointless, right? I'm waiting for them to play Odin, but I could freeze their face for like eight turns in a row. They don't need Odin. Okay, I, I, the game. another spotlight chat. Dude, I can't deal with this card, dude. Ruining my life. I'm just waiting for them to play Odin. One man at Unar. One man at Unar is free. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Hilarious. <laughs> oh my god, what is, what is this game, dude? Alright, they're gonna have to play Odin eventually. And then I'll start freezing their face. I'm really doubting they vote. Well, dude, 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 how do they like? How do they win then? Dude, I could get three spotlights. <laughs> oh, dude. Don't use your head. Mine. 
Let's go, mirror images, dude. But if I just like control the board forever, you know? Uh, I need an Inquisitor though. I'm gonna win this, right? I can do crime deprivation forever, dude. Alright, well. I could also, like, draw the rest of my deck. I don't know. Do you believe in zodiac signs? Um, so, zodiac signs are something that uh, people think exists, so I do believe in them. Yeah. Reverb on Salesman is good against Warrior. I could have done that, to be honest. Yeah. Kind of made sense, to be honest. Um, That was an error. What to do? What to do? Not bad.
<laughs> Dude, I don't even know who's winning this. Chad, I can get two sifts now. Um, do I ever... I kind of like all the cards in my hand. Yeah, I could do a sif and then do another sif, right? So... I don't know. Let's do... Might overdraw here. I think I'm okay with it. Dude, the temporary ones are bad, dude. It's like Jaina's gift off this card is so bad. Two sifts at the same time. I don't even know who's winning this game. But most of my deck sucks, so... Only card I want to top deck is Miracle Salesman here. Still a two damage spell, yeah, but like they gain more armor than no one is winning this game. I don't know. We'll see. Mm. Oh. <coughs> Wait. <coughs> Wait, now I can... Wait, I can... I can steal this! I can steal this jerkwad and then do it myself! Wait, what? That is the play, dude. Alright, here we go, here we go. <laughs> yes, chat! And I get like tons of excavation chat now. What are you gonna be in this game for? It's been chat, what's it? It's been fifty-two. Wait, son of a These are kind of illegal. I mean, this getting buffed was kind of illegal. Wait, what are you what are you doing here? That was a great way. Oh, I could actually use this. But.
<laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, uh, they just go infinite on me, bro? Oh, they do. Okay, that's not good. Well, what are we gonna do? We're gonna go in? Ooh, I can get um, a nature spell for my next Sif, right? Wait, but uh, I can get a swipe. I don't know. They haven't played Odin. I think I'm just gonna freeze uh, this. One dose solves any problem. Yeah. Probably not worth it. Do I have a reverb? I have a. If I can dump enough cards, I can reverberations and then steal this, right? Or I can reverberations and steal their Finley. Uh, wait, steal steal their Fizzle. Um. Okay, and then, but the problem is my hand is so full of clutter here that like I don't get a lot of my stuff, right? But I do know, so I can reverberations this guy. Take that. All right, let's take the bird. Let's see what we get here. Let's see if we get something good. Wait, wait, wait. What? 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 Okay, this is what Pocket Train was telling me about. Okay, okay. Um. Are we gonna win this? I think we're gonna win this chat. I just have a feeling. I don't know. Um, we can still just use Sif for raw damage here. I hope you get benefits from this. Happy B Day, man. Favorite HS streamer. Thank you for doing what you do. Thank you for the 300 bits. 
Oh, is no birthday sex call? I was going to, and I'm kind of just want to stay home. Um, but it would be fun. There is a bit big sex cult thing, but. <laughs> dude! Dude! We want that! We want that, dude! Oh my god, dude! <laughs> Oh, Warriors in chat to say GG. Oh, which one? I did. I missed that death. It was a uh, Korean radish. Oh, dude. Oh, happy birthday. All right. <laughs> Korean radish, dude. That was a uh, that was a pretty crazy game. GG. Bro, this is my punish, dude. Chat, never, I mean, by punished, I mean never punish, bro. I have no idea how to play this mage deck. It's not that hard. Um... This deck is easy because it has what for players because if you, if you know how to control the board It has very well-defined win conditions. What do I mean by well-defined win conditions? You might say mr. Streamer um, wait, ooh. Keeper strength is insane, but like This is better because like I can play right now keepers is awkward how to pull off so well-defined win conditions is a very clear path to victory. Aggro usually is the easiest well-defined win condition. You curve out, you play it, you get ahead on board, you l utilize your board and tempo advantage to go for a win before your opponents can stop you. And if your opponents are bad players, it's very easy to do this. Um, Ooh, this is an interesting because cry cry privation is insane, but so is arcane intellect because I get to play it, and I really want to just draw my good cards. I think. Okay, this is good, right? Was it a rerun? Yeah, I well, I learn I learn little routines, dude. I learn how to explain something and I say it again it's not you know it's not it's not uh, it's not like some weird conspiracy all right it just that's how it is so you know that makes sense Choice are much more fun. <laughs> What you wanted to say? Oh yeah, so it's got a well-defined win conditions. So players can do well with this deck that you know you don't need to be pocket trained to win with the deck, all right? You just like spend your mana, you control the board, you don't let your opponent get too ahead, all right? While you try to play all your all your spells. And you eventually draw a Sif and you shoot him in the face. Dude, easy, dude. What to do? What to do? Okay, I think I'll take um
Screw it, I'm just gonna... Tempo out here. <clears throat> Our minions cost one less. Uh, I got a randomly generated nature spell that uh, reduces all the attack on my minions, but also the uh, the cost. So quite good with the deck. We're gonna have a five mana sift if we ever draw it, so... I'm just waiting for Casey to commit over here. He keeps not committing. There he goes. All right, Mr. Casey. Let's see what you got. I can just kill one of these. My hand is too full. Vampire timer, yeah, he's German. Um, why not send the rusher back? I want you to answer your own question, Flying. So, what is better, right? An eight mana eight eight with rush, or zero mana eight eight? When my opponent has tons of cards, what do you think? Do I want to spend a, send him back a card? Um, yeah. So, well, so when I get rid of this one, the issue is they can go break dance on the 8 8 and then play it again. Where they break dance this, it's not very good. So, we definitely want the regular playhouse back in their hand. Um, they can still, well, it's more, no, if they had the 8-8 eight, eight on board versus the, this 8-8, eight, eight, right? They didn't have, we didn't know if they had the second one in hand. So let's say they have the, if I, if I leave this one on board and they top deck, uh, break dance, they can play the break dance and then replay this where if they break dance the normal 8-8, eight, eight, then, then they have an awkward 8-8 eight, eight in their hand. You know, it makes sense. So it just killed it. Yeah. So I basically would rather kill this than kill the other one. This kind of play too, right? Hmm, it's bad though. Bro. Wait, did he actually bait me so he could do this double stealth play? Oh my god. Is, is this Casey? Is this, wait, do I just have lethal though? Do you have another stealthy boy? Because I'm just going to freeze it and gain life, you know? Mm. Oh, I see. All right, I think I just gained a ridiculous amount of armor here.
I can't go face, he's got taunted. There's the wind fury, bro. We've created a temporary. Saw this one coming. Go face with the spell. I'm gonna clear the board and I'm gonna win. And uh yeah. So Wow, I actually needed that life. It's crazy, dude. I might have lethal, but let's just take the win. Um, yeah, yeah. No Tom six oh two two eight. Do me and Tom six oh two two eight go way back, dude? This was really good at the previous game. Um, against uh, wait, this is D this is Death Knight. Why did I think this was, dude? I thought this was Demon Hunter, dude. So I took this, like, to beat Demon Hunter? Bruh. That was a questionable line. Dude, the card pocket train thinks is broken, dude. This is like good value. Yeah, I kind of want this. I could play it on six. I did rate it four stars, dude. Got that right. I did not get um. I did not get wheel right. But wheel is probably not a four star card. It's probably like a three. I mean, it is a build around, but it hasn't like. Do another one and. The battle. Turn of verb is pretty good. I think it's like a good win condition for Sif, right? Is that deck legit? Yep.
The citadel stands strong! The record is your opponent. Um, it's somewhere in the settings. Uh, just go in the settings. But uh, I don't want to distract the stream from that. Uh, you can figure that out. But it's like you got to go into the settings on the left. So. Oh, these suck. Um, do I really like tumbleweed? No. Uh, take. This is useless, but it's a nature spell. I don't know what to do here. Does frost wait frost stopper um molten uh, I don't know like molten rude um does things there could be a better card I don't I don't have a strong opinion on it um or molten rude also gives you value which can matter like it's a way to get uh, other spells other than discovery magic so nomad farmer they give the forty months thank you get on such anything so much nomad farmer. Manage, manage over your party. I know a guy, dude. Like we could have, I already had it. So next time. And that's unfortunate. That's a lot of heal. Did I throw by not playing the uh, snake oil? I was a little afraid of uh, getting um, ratted there. How much damage do I have here now? This is 14? 14? No, it looks like I have it exactly right. 14, 16, 32. Rune Mage's master all magic. 
Yeah. I didn't play the snake oil salesman. Uh, I didn't play the snake oil salesman because I thought I likely had lethal next turn. I didn't. Um, so I'm gonna throw him away. I'm not sure. But this is this is the card to to win. Um, for some reason, I don't know if I, I buy this, but I do buy this. Uh, I don't buy this. That's that good. All right, hit Miracle Salesman. This is a great turn one play. Um, allows us to develop tempo uh, and allows us to get a snake oil that we can either use for Sif later or just to trade to, to better cards. Uh, the, um, so I could go Flame Geyser and trade this off or ping. Um, I'm not really sure. So the nice thing about Flame Geyser uh, is but, um, but I think I slightly prefer ping here. Um, I'm not exactly sure why, uh, it just conserves value, uh, but I, I could see Flame Geyser being correct there. I just don't really feel like thinking about it that long. This seems reasonable. Um, they got the weapon here, unfortunately, though. Um, yeah. Alright, I'd like to have... So I'm gonna trade here because I have a better chance of hitting Frostbolt than by doing than doing Discovery here. Um, so I've decided this. I think I'm gonna save my Flame Geyser. I'm gonna go my Discovery. Um, we hit another Frost Lich. I could take this Fell card too. Uh, I could also take this Lightning Storm. There are actually all decent choices, um, and I'm really not sure what the best play is here. Uh, so you know what? Are, uh, you know what? I I think it's I think it's smokestack because if they go the th six five and trade on my miracle salesman, I have a nice reverberations plus smokestack clear, and that's the most likely play for next turn. So by having an answer to their six five immediately, uh, it allows me to neutralize their tempo advantage. Uh, otherwise, I'm all, um, when they have a very likely play and I don't have a play for it, uh, that's a bad thing. Where this allows me to get my fell, it gets me an excavate card. Um, so it does a lot of good things for us here. Um, even though, you know, this is the, the typically stronger card, uh, having a card that's really good for next turn is very valuable. So now I'm going to go Reverberations on this. This makes it have one health effectively. Uh, and then I go this, uh, which kills it. And it gives me a card, uh, which happens to be Pouch of Coins, which is great. Because now that enables me to go Kaggar next turn. I don't have to go Kaggar, but if they do a weak play, it's really nice to have this option. Because this is a slow value card. A slow value card... Um, is effectively, uh, you know, let's say you go on vacation and you want to buy a package that gets you free alcohol for the next week. Well, if you're if you're going uh, away next the next day, well, then you don't really need that. But if you're going to be there for a whole another week, uh, it's a great deal. So um, I'm going to go pouch of coins here, uh, like I said, to get two coins, and then I get to play out the Cadgar. This gets me a lot of value, and I have a lot of time. They don't have a weak, strong board except for their McTheridon. So this gets us just a lot of stuff. We already got a counter spell. Um, so not only do we get the 5-5, five five, but we get a bunch of spells. Even though they're random, they're still kind of good. Um, you know, like so, you get an Ice Bear, you gain 8 life, you get a Frost Bowl on a minion, uh, stuff like that. This is the Mage Deck win condition. Uh, the Mage Deck win condition is kill them. Put their life so... You want to see they're at 24 life. We need to make that one less 24 more times. We could do it in bigger clumps too. So that's our win condition. Uh, get this life down to zero. Um, now, but the problem is if our opponent puts our life down to zero, it makes it harder to put their life down to zero because you can't play the game once your life goes down to zero. So we also have to like stop them from putting our life down to zero, if that makes sense. I don't know if that's too complicated, but let me know in the comments. Um, so, all right, I have to decide what I want to do this turn. Um, I think I want to clear this Jerkwad, uh, so I'm just going to spend all my mana. I'm going to do this. Uh, I will eat the Frost Lich. This gets me uh, a Water Elemental, and Water Elementals are hella annoying for Demon Hunter. And I'm going to play the Flame Elemental. I could have traded the Snake Oil, but uh, I'd rather spend developing. This is a nice pickup. Clears their board. Um, you know, we'd rather go face there, to be honest, but there are benefits of killing this Window Shopper. They can't bounce it back, so...
All right. Um, I'm sorry I didn't trade. So, um, I think I want. So this is two secrets, but these go at the end of the turn. So my inquisitive creation always can clear this. So I think I'm gonna go face first. Not ice barrier, and then I go inquisitive, and um, um, this is nice. This worked out. Ah, I took a lot of damage to be honest here, but I did freeze her face, and then afterwards I'm going to trade this to get a better card, and bam. My order was technically incorrect, but I can live with that. Um, so we got a water elemental. They have a frozen face. We have 18 life, but we're doing okay. All right. Streamers heaven. Um, only if we played good moral decks like Control Priest. All right. If you play dirt, uh, you know. Like you have to play good high value control decks. All right. If you play like a any sort of OTK, now if you did some like cards, the decks that are kind of like on the wait, uh, son of a gun, dude. Oh, dude, I'm gonna get rat trapped. All right, I'm in big trouble, chap. Um, because I'm probably gonna get rat trapped here. Um, I just gotta play cards here. I'm probably getting Rapture. I'm gonna take Blizzard because I can clear. I can clear, but I don't really want to attack face. Uh, I guess I could just Frostbolt this. Um, so I can say a live turn. Mm. Ooh, Skitterbot's nice. Okay, I'm just gonna Frostbolt here or Blizzard here. Um, I'm afraid to go face because of freeze freezing trap, so I'm gonna pass. No, the other blizzard, bro. That's how it works. Was freezing trap? Okay. <laughs> Those do I keep for Sif? Um, just some damage. Um, I think if you start off, don't worry about like overusing cards. Um, like when you're up against like a war like a life gaining class you sometimes have to but usually if you're just kind of like you keep like you know you don't use your snake oils and you have like a flame geyser like it's often you can get a kill you know so keep blizzard for sip board clear dude keep you in the chat for great comments at <laughs> strategies dude um So I want to gain a lot of life here. I'm very afraid. Um, let me think. So I want to spend six mana on these jerk buds. Um, I can go face and freeze it. Uh, so I'm gonna do this twice. I guess I should do this first here. Um, all right. I hit. Um, I could do taunts, but I think I just want to smite here. Uh, smite seems just really convenient. Um, taunts are a little less convenient because uh, I get to kill this. Uh, I'm just gonna freeze their face for security here, or freeze this again because I just I'm 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 very much ahead in some ways. But wait, no, dude. Wait, oh, good thing I double fro froze though, because because I double froze, I don't I might not get another chance to heal there. So I uh, yeah. Wait, they didn't attack. <laughs> All right, my opponent uh, gave up, dude. 